African American history to me is a time to reflect and learn from where we came from. We still have a lot of work to do, but the only way as a people African Americans are gonna get better is, is, is if every day we reflect on our history, look at all the sacrifices that our ancestors have made and the struggles that they've made, and use that as a motivation to be that the best that we can be. And when we make it, to reach back and help others. Well, Black History Month was originated by a historian by the name of G. Carter Woodson, Harvard University graduate. 1926, he started what was known as Black History Week. And it was to commemorate the, the birthdays of uh, Abraham Lincoln and Frederick Douglass, the abolitionists, because their birthdays fell during the same week. And in 1976, Gerald Ford was the president and pronounced and proclamated us to have a Black History Month. So that's a little bit about the history of it. Having been 66 years old now, um, I have an opportunity to live some of the black history. I was born in 1956. Two years after Brown versus Board of Education found that the education, separate but equal, was unconstitutional. Um, I lived through the Civil Rights Movement in, in, the, in the 60s and, uh, and have seen a lot of changes. When I think about uh, being an African-American male, uh, and when the Constitution was founded and written, a person of my color would have no rights, no right to own property, no right to earn money, no freedom whatsoever. And, that, and that's what the Constitution described the rights that African-American men had. We had none. Um, I can say that my grandfather's grandfather was born a slave uh, in West Virginia. And knowing the history that he escaped and joined the Union Army to help and fight for the freedom of others means a lot to me. It means a lot to my family members. I have a father who was the first African-American firefighter in 1964 and only in New York. And I think because of the opportunities that he had um, has made the lives of members of my family much better because I have a daughter that's a lawyer, a daughter that is a, a physician, and a son that's a commercial airline pilot. And none of those things, uh, when I was in high school, um, could I envision. Because when I graduated from high school, I did not know an African-American doctor, lawyer, or an airline pilot. And now when I sit across the kitchen table, uh, I see all three of those.